morning, YouTube, friends and family. Saturday, guys, I got a soccer game to go to with twins. Andre has already headed off to take Milo to his cross country. I'm so dirty, I don't even feel clean enough to like go to a soccer game. Thanks for coming with me on my day, and I will see you in a few. so much better. probably get like three. We could put a couple in the freezer, couldn't we? Welcome to Bailey's Orchard. This is in the next town north from us and this is like our local real deal um, apple orchard. They have dozens of different varieties of apples and they have plums and they have pears and all kinds of good stuff. We are so excited to get some fresh cider to make some mulled cider this weekend. So this has just been a ritual for us every year is to come to Bailey's Orchard. So if you're ever in Windsor, Maine, check it out. I stand corrected. The boys just reminded me that this is in fact Whitefield, Maine. So this is our town near the north edge of it. Come to Bailey's Orchard in Whitefield. Christmas last year, my brother got the twins each a set of throwing knives. You might think a 10 year old is a little bit young to have throwing knives, and you're probably right. However, um, we hung on to them, put them away in a drawer, and now that they're 11 and a little bit more responsible, uh, they have rekindled their relationship with their throwing knives. So we're gonna have a little bit of fun today with them. Here. Ooh, now you're getting it. That's it.
Putting a flashlight on the end of a cordless drill was a genius idea. I don't know who the engineer was who came up with this idea, but I hope he's a quadzillionaire. I am very excited to open up that package. That is a surprise that I'm saving for later, okay? I don't know what it is, but I'm, I am pretty anxious to open it up, but I didn't want to just like tear into it. I thought, you know what? I'll finish what I needed to do today and then have maybe a little reward. I w I'm thinking that this package is uh, uh, related to my vlog. I'll just say that. Every year I mow this field here, you know. If I don't mow it, then the woody plants, like this alder and there's some willow, the woody plants will like t take over the field and it'll just grow back into forest. And we kind of like having a little bit of open space around our house uh, for air circulation, for change in habitat, and uh, because of all the wildflowers and birds that it attracts. So I don't own like a field mower or a bush hog or a brush hog um, or cutters. So my father, he's got like every piece of equipment under the sun. So I'm gonna go borrow his Kubota tractor that has a bush hog on it. And I guess he got a brand new bush hog. His words were, I just bought a brand new bush hog that not even you could break. I've had a little history of being rough on his equipment, you know, but like I told him, every time I break something, I learn something. I learn how to better operate the machine. As the crow flies, my father's house is really not that far away from my house. It is across this river and it is in a different county and it is in a different town, I like to say, but through the woods, it's, it's under a mile. So I'm just gonna walk over there because then I don't have to deal with, it's just, and it's more fun to get out and walk the walk as opposed to drive all the way around. You know, it's less than a mile directly through the woods and it's like four miles by road. Does your dad collect old telephone poles like my dad does?
off to a birthday party. That leaves me and Milo home alone. Oh, I can't wait to open that special package. to open up that special package. Uh, it doesn't say who it's from, but I have some pretty strong suspicions. But I am literally going to wait overnight until tomorrow morning. And it's gonna be one of the first things I'll do. And that way the twins will be here because I think that they're pretty excited to see it opened up as well. And they're at a party right now. So I'm gonna take this time and update my subscriber map uh, for a uh, 20. There's like two dozen new place pins to put up there. I'm so excited. Thanks for coming with me on my day. It was a great day. A lot happened. And I felt good about everything that I did. I hope you felt the same way. I'll see you tomorrow. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that.